Okay, so now we are going to talk about the binary search tree uh, property that an in-order traversal of a binary search tree always lists the keys of the nodes in the tree in a sorted order. So before that we need to know what is a binary search tree. In a binary search tree, uh, if you take any node, its left subtree is going to have keys that are less than the value of the node. So in this case, for 8, all, its, all the nodes in its left subtree are going to have value less than 8. Similarly, all the nodes to the right subtree will have values greater than that node. So in this case, the nodes to the right of 8 all have values greater than 8. Okay. And this property is maintained at every intermediate node. So if you take 3, its left child, uh, left subtree basically has all nodes less than or equal to 3. In this case, it is less than 3. And all the nodes in its right subtree have value greater than this node. Okay, so it is recursively true for every intermediate node. So on such a binary search tree, if we do a kind of in-order traversal, the uh, listing of the keys is always a sorted order. Like if we do a in-order traversal on this binary search tree, uh, how do we do in-order traversal? We go to the left child, left node, then center and right. So start here this is the center so we have to visit the left so we set the left this is center so it's the left so this is a, there's nothing more else so this is one then after you sit to the left child you go to the root or the center which is three so one three and then go to the right so this is a center so go to the left so four then center which is six then right which is seven then go to this center which is eight then go to the right this is a center so go to the left center left so 10 then center then center 13 14 so this is a sorted order so how do we prove this okay so let there be two keys k1 and k2 which are different from each other uh, and also having a relationship that k1 less than k2 so if k1 is less than k2 when we do a in order traversal of the binary search tree having k1 and k2 then k1 should appear somewhere before k2 okay on the in the traversal list so there are three possibilities for different uh, ways they may appear if k1 and k2 we know they're different but let's say there's a common node k3 kind of like a common ancestor somewhere above them connecting them in the binary search tree now this actually indicates there could be one or more intermediate nodes connecting k1 and k3 similarly one or more intermediate nodes connecting k2 and k3 all right so if we were do, to do uh, in order traversal of this binary search tree we come to k3 it's just a center so we go to all the left nodes and then we reach eventually say k1 so k1 should be listed first followed by centered node k3 followed by the right nodes uh, right side nodes which includes k2 so which means k1 first followed by k3 after a while and then followed by k2 after a while so k1 appears before k2 right all right the other possibility is for k3 to be equal to k1 so if that is the case then k2 should appear to the right of k3 because k3 is equal to k1 and since k1 is going to be less than k2 k2 should appear to the right of k3 or k1 right in this case so if you do an in order traversal on this you kind of visit the center first or the left actually there's nothing on the left so let's say you visit the center now k1 which is also k3 and then after a while followed by k2 so again k1 appears before k2 now the other possibility is k3 to could be equal to k2 then since k1 is less than than k2 uh k1 should appear to the left of k3 and k2 right so um when you do now an in order traversal k1 is going to be listed first followed by somebody says in the center k2 so again k1 appears before k2 so any of those situations when k1 is less than k2 and there are two different nodes k1 always appears before somewhere before k2 in a in order traversal and this holds good for every pair of keys in a binary search tree so a listing of the vertices of a binary search tree um, using in order traversal always results in a sorted order okay